It's been a little while since I played this since the last demo, which was like, what, a month and a half ago or something? Two months ago? Uh, I wasn't really going to play it, but uh, apparently there's supposed to be a new area. Uh, I think there's even a new boss, and people have said that the game runs a lot more smoothly now. So I definitely want to try it and see how that smooth uh, gameplay is for Code Vein. What the hell is this overall balance? Oh, I see. The balance. <laughs> I like how that's under advanced settings. Make sure you don't touch it unless you're an advanced player. All right. You an advanced player? All right, good. How big do you want her breasts? Cat ears. You can give them cat ears. Oh no, my A button broke. Oh damn, I picked the cat ears. Oh shoot, I don't know how to change it now. Oh, something's wrong. It's not letting me take off the cat ears. Dang it. Oh shucks. What's her name? I don't know, man. Maya. Oh, code name? Zaki. All right, so we remember this. First, let's go ahead and get a clickbait picture for my thumbnail because we know what we see here one of the biggest plot drivers jesus lots of jiggle physics did they add more jiggle physics they might have they literally jiggle in the wind but uh we're just trying it out even though it's kind of similar to the same one we uh had last time people were saying there's new things also that it runs smoother i i kind of guess it's you know Feels kind of the same. Ah, be careful with the slug creature. It's dead. This is where pussy ass Oliver gets bit or scratched or whatever. I oh, don't know, his mask breaks. How did he ever think he was not okay? Or okay at all? He's literally eating ground. Spoiler alert, he's a boss in a couple minutes. Backstabs in this game are real wonky, man. You can pretty much do them on Will. And this is Will right here. Oh shit! Uh oh. Not good, not good. You're under control, don't panic. Gotcha, bitch. <laughs> You're in control. A local pendant. Those things are still chasing me? Yo, fuck off, dudes. Need to be real careful. Got him. I was almost slain by slugs. Any other weapons? Let's see, what is this weapon? Ooh, what does it use? Bull oh, it uses the I-Core. How good is it? It has the range of a pickle. Wow, it really does have the range of a pickle and not even a good one either. Oh, super big guy with big ultra great, so we gotta be careful with him. Nice waste. Dude, there's a couple of big guys here. Let's see if we can attract this one to come over here. Right now very big guy can we charge this god that pickle range dude is it just me or does it seem kind of easier than the first demo obviously there i at least i don't think there is i don't think there's any difficulty sliders it's all kind of the same difficulty it seems a little bit easier. I remember those guys just destroying me. And last time I had a, the straight sword, which is like the best weapon. Ow. One of the things that's still the most annoying was the freaking characters that do not shut the hell up and it's still there. No, I didn't pick something up that we can use. I picked something up that I can use. Character. 
If it isn't the guy from the beginning whose name I can't remember. Can I backstab him? No. Oops. Wow, he did that at the most perfect time, right when I was buffing. <laughs> He's got dreads. Is this boss the same? It looks a little different. Oh, that fireball's so good. I missed that thing. Shoot him in the ass! Oh! Nani! Got him. No, I forgot it has the range of a pickle. Got him. Oh, we got his weapon. Juggernaut Sledgehammer. I don't think we got that last time. I'll touch that. What is that? Oh, I shouldn't have touched it. Look at that. She moved less than an inch and they flapped a mile. So, so far it feels... I don't know if they changed anything. Maybe it's because I've been playing a lot of PvE stuff with Dark Souls. But it's not even that, I don't think. That it feels much easier. It just feels like things did less damage. Uh, stamina felt about the same, but it felt like I did more damage as well. We saw all of this in the last demo. I'm just trying to get to the new things. Lie down. Hey, just like in Nier, we can watch her lie down. You weren't looking at anything, weirdo. We're gonna, we're not gonna to be this character up. What the hell was that zoom? Head to the depths. Okay, there we go. This is the new one. Den of Darkness. Den of Darkness is uh, the new depth area. The other one was all right. It had uh, a couple nice bosses. A very cool final boss. So we'll see what we get in this one. So this is new. The Den of Darkness. Ooh, it kind of has like the same type of layout, to be honest. Yakumo is a monster. So I'm going to go with Yakumo. I don't know if they lowered his abilities, but he was insane when uh, the first demo was out. Wait a minute. Is that a boss fight already? That was quick. Gifted Yakumo reduces guard, stamina usage, and dodge speed, but increases attack. I guess we could try that. Cool. I guess solar rolls, but ow. Who's this thought? Oh, I backstabbed her ass. Queen's Vanguard. Yakumo's insane! Dude, look at Yakumo! Aw, oh, he stole my glory! Wow, that was quick. Just pure annihilation. As this is her start after beating a boss? Oh, okay. This fucking thing. What? How did that guy not get hit? Again? This is where they could have had invasions. Another one is here. Gotta be very careful. Yukumo! <laughs> the heck? Oh, it did waste my attack. Shh. 
shit. How is there still more? What am I supposed to do? Open it? Is that it? Oh my god, how are there still more? Shit. Real close to death here. Well, I missed all those attacks. There you go. Holy hell, that was a lot of them. Okay, so that's it on this front, huh? That's all there was here? What was that? A barrel of trash. Never mind, let's move on. Tricking. I guess that he was slick. to death. Den of Darkness key. Damn, we already unlocked the final boss, huh? Uh. Well, that worked out perfectly. <laughs> I even hit him one time. That was so pathetic. Oh, boss fight. Oh, hell yeah. There's the big titty lady. Ow. They hit me. I was distracted with jiggle physics. How did I go from 1100 to zero in one second? Jesus Christ. What happened there? They must have both hit me at the same time or something. They're both raging noble women. Damn it! I hate you get stuck in some long ass animations and then you uh you can't get out of them, so you just get hit. Okay, there's one. Boy. That was a nice combo there. We got the raging noble women. You know they're noble because they didn't smother me to death. They could have easily, but they didn't. All right, so we got our two keys. Uh, let's see what boss fight we got next, I guess. Let's see what this boss is. Ooh. Shrouded in red mystery, huh? Hey, is this guy? The Queen's Knight. We did beat him. We're whooping him. Run! Oh, your Kumo ain't scared, dude. Nani! Did he stagger him? What happened? Oh, he did. Shit. Oh, I didn't mean to attack. Jesus. Why did I hear his double voice there? That was really odd. Oh, I 
な立ち回りはやめとけよ Where are you going? <laughs> He landed dead. <laughs> Got him. We killed him before he left. So when he landed back down, his that was his corpse splatting down on the concrete. So that was it. So we did fight that guy in the first demo, and he wasn't even like he was a side thing in the main thing. And then we got like a bunch of unique stuff in the uh, the depths or whatever. All right, so I guess that's what we got for Code Vein. You know, still interesting. The game comes out a little bit later this month, and I'll definitely be playing it whenever it does.